What's up guys, Justin here with TheSketchUpEssentials.com, back with another SketchUp quick tutorial for you. So today we're going to go ahead and we're going to make a twisted bar shape in SketchUp. So let's go ahead and just jump into it. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to start off and you're just going to draw a square, um, whatever the size of your bar is going to be. So let's say it's a 6 inch by 6 inch, you can just uh, set one corner with the rectangle tool, type in 6 comma 6, hit that enter key. And uh, so what we're going to do now is we're going to use the push-pull tool to extrude that a little bit so that we've got a little straight piece before we get started. Then uh, use the uh, push-pull tool in, um, in uh, create new starting face mode. So activate the push-pull tool by tapping the P key. Click on this face and tap the control key. You can see that'll start a new face. And so then what you're going to do is you're going to come in here and what I do is I go ahead and draw a little line. Um, to the midpoint of this square. Um, I just find that makes everything easier. So you're gonna go ahead and make one bar piece like this and then use the move tool to create a copy of that. Um, so use the move tool by tapping the M key, click on the corner and tap that control key. And then come in here with the rotate tool and rotate this bar 15 degrees. So you're gonna rotate that 15 degrees and then you're gonna copy this box up again and you're gonna do the same thing. So rotate this 15 degrees and you're gonna make several different copies of this. So use the move tool, create another copy, rotate this one 15 degrees. Go ahead and make this until you've got one complete rotation. So go here, rotate this 15 degrees. So now you see we've got one complete rotation in here. And then uh, you can erase this top box because now what we're gonna do is we're gonna come down here and we're gonna select all of this and we're just gonna make a copy up to the top. And you can type in times three or times four or whatever you want. Um, you see it just copies this along this piece and so now you've got this nice twisted bar shape. So the last thing you can do in the shape is if you see this creates a little bit of funky geometry in here, what you can do is you can come in here and you can select all of this and you can right click and click soften and smooth ed edges. And you can see what that does is that comes in here and that kind of smooths everything out so you don't have the funky geometry in here anymore. And if that doesn't work exactly right for you, um, over here in the tray, when you select that soften and smooth, uh, it should pop up this little thing that says soften edges. And you can adjust this slider. You see how this is like softening the edges way too much? So you can just use this slider to adjust the way that that looks. So. Um, See if I turn on hidden geometry in here, you know that stuff is still in there, but SketchUp just kind of hides it and softens it so it's much more uniform. So, and this can be used for a lot of different things, be it stair rails or um, you can use it for cables or anything else. You can do a lot of different stuff with this. So anyway, if you like this video, remember to click that like button down below. If you're new around here, remember to click that subscribe button for new SketchUp content every week. Uh, if you really like what I'm doing, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Um, that just helps me keep bringing uh, great SketchUp content to you. Every little bit helps, even if it's a dollar a month. But in any case, I really appreciate you taking the time to watch this and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks guys.